Um, I teach in the English department at Carnegie Mellon University where we also have a very strong conservatory school of drama. And I teach performance studies and the, my, my favorite, most memorable Shakespeare performance actually is a production of A Midsummer Night's Dream that we studied as a class. It was a seminar I was teaching. Uh, the students were a mix of English students um, and students from the School of Drama and music performance students. So it was quite an eclectic group. And I have a colleague in the School of Drama, uh, a director named Don Wadsworth, who was kind enough to let my students do an ethnographic study of the whole production process. So we were there from the table work all the way to the final uh, performance of this play. And, and it was a lovely performance. Uh, these were all student actors. Um, two of them were students in my class, in fact, that semester. Um, the School of Drama is very high powered. One of the uh, performers in that production did go on, uh, Corey Cott, to star in Newsies uh, on Broadway later on. But um, what I really remember about that performance is not so much what happened on the stage, but what happened in the community of performers and audience members in my seminar. Uh, I remember at the, the opening night, we all went to the theater after having, of course, watched this play multiple times. I mean, have you ever sat through a tech week? Mm -hmm. We are talking incredible tedium, but they knew the play called. But one of my students turned to me and said, I finally understand the concept of communitas, which is the anthropologist Victor Turner's term for that kind of magical sense of belonging and togetherness that comes from theatrical performance and being a part of that as both audience and performance and performer. That, that was kind of one of my peak moments with Shakespeare, I think.